Hi guys, it's time for Theme Thursday and I got this sweet little darling with me today for Theme Thursday and she's got this sweet little bow in her hair and she's adorable. She's a little strawberry blonde with barely there eyelashes. I believe she is the sweet pea asleep. Um, don't quote me if I'm wrong. I'm not sure. But anyways, look at those eyes. They look so realistic sleeping and her cute little nose. And look at those sweet, sweet little lips. Oh my goodness. She is absolutely adorable. So let's get to theme Thursday. <laughs> she is wearing this denim overalls. And I have her little tootsies out barefoot because I thought her feet were so adorable that I had to show off those little toes. So, so cute. Oh, look at those feet. They're adorable. Anyways, the theme for this week was either de um, navy blue, I believe it was, or denim. And I really don't have any navy blue clothes for the babies. And you know, that dark blue. But I do have a couple of denim outfits. So I thought I, this one was my favorite. So, anyways, when my kids were little, I loved Oshkosh because that was my favorite thing to dress my daughter in when she was a baby. Some. Oh my good, almost 28 years now ago. Oh, I feel like I'm getting old. <laughs> so, anyways, yeah. So I love Oshkosh Bigosh. And if I find them in the thrift store and stuff, I grab them. I have had this outfit, or this little overalls, I believe, for about five years now. Because it's one of my favorites. So whenever I can find Oshkosh Bigosh, here, let me show you this real quick. She's going to stop doing it. She loves playing with pieces of food. I don't know. Have you ever seen a dog do that where they'll play with a piece of food? It's the weirdest thing. So I had to share that. I've never seen a dog do that. So she looks so sweet. Yeah, I love Oshkosh B. Gosh, I would, this reminds me of my daughter because I would dress her in Oshkosh B. Out outfits and they were my favorite thing. And I thought they were so sweet and she looked so cute. And I raised them in Portland, Oregon and I'd go downtown and go to Nordstrom's and look in the clearance section or I'd save up and get her a little cute Oshkosh outfit and I always got compliments on how cute my kids were dressed so yeah but I want to show this baby she's so cute she's got adorable hair I didn't fix it up but I did put that little headband in and so we're going to have a quiet theme Thursday today. I need to do some cleaning around the house. I stripped my bed and washing the sheets and all that fun stuff. So I'm going to make the bed today with fresh sheets. And then tomorrow we're going to the grocery store. So that will be fun to get some food and things that we need for the house. So, still looking for a job, but um, I might do some volunteering at a local thrift store around here. It's more of an upscale thrift store, but it benefits the local animal shelter. So, I'm going to try to do that if I can. They got lots of volunteers, so I don't know if they'll need me or not. Hi. Hi, Miss Chica. What you doing? Oh, little Miss Jealous. Are you jealous of the baby? Yeah, it's funny how they will get jealous because I'm paying attention to a doll. Yes, you do. You get jealous all the time. You're so cute. Yes. 
You're just as cute as a reborn baby. Yes, you are. Oh, you gave the baby a kiss? That's a good girl. Yeah, but this little one came out of Charlotte's nursery. And I just love her. To me, she looks very realistic. So sweet. I don't know who her artist is. So I would have to probably look back through some of Charlotte's old videos or ask Charlotte. I think Charlotte knows. But she is so, so cute. I love her complexion, the skin tone. That the lips are not too bright, but they look very realistic. And the blushing looks very realistic because she's a bigger baby. So she wears about, oh, she can wear three to six months, sorry, <clears throat> or six to nine months. And I love my, I love the little babies, but I also love my bigger babies too. Uh, who am I kidding? I love all the babies. One day I want to get some masterpiece dolls or add a child size doll to my collection. That would be really fun. Um, but for now, I'm happy and content with my collection. So once I get a job, though, look out. <laughs> yeah, so, but I'll be saving some money too because I'm getting older and I got to think about my retirement and what I'm going to do in the future. So, look at her. She's so sweet. Can we show everybody your adorable little hands? Look at those details on those nails. Focus, focus, camera. Such a cute little baby. So... I don't know. Let's see. I'm trying to think of anything else I can talk to you about for Theme Thursday. Yeah, but I, yeah, I just love denim on babies. I think it looks absolutely adorable. The dogs kind of knocked all the pillows off my couch. So I'm trying not to show up my messy living room that I got to clean up. <laughs> they are so messy. And she's got her little ears pierced. So cute. With little pearl earrings. So, but yeah, if you guys could say a prayer for me and send or send positive vibes that hopefully I'll find a job soon. See, when I moved down here, my parents thought they had a job lined up for me, but the manager they had been talking to, he had quit. And so now it's just a waiting game for me at that store with the different manager because he thought he had an opening i did an interview i did really well on the interview and then i guess another employee from the back moved to the front so then he didn't have the hours for me and he doesn't have enough hours for me now and it's a really good place to work because none of the employees want to quit <laughs> so that's a good sign sorry about that the dog started barking so anyways Nobody wants to quit from that store, so it's hard to get on, but it would be a really good place to work. So, oh, it's just kind of frustrating because money is getting tighter and tighter, and there's things I want to do, and money I want to save, and things I want to buy, and you guys know how that goes when you're broke <laughs> you know it's no fun because there's so many cute babies out there there's that new little chunky sleeping baby that i can't think of the name right off the hand i would love to get that sculpt and make him my mom wants a little preemie awake baby and i'd love to make her one one day and I know there's some beautiful smiling kids I would love to add to my collection. And as I said, my goal one day is to get a masterpiece child-sized doll or a bigger toddler would be nice. Somebody to watch over the babies. And I want to get a crib so or two so I can display the babies nicely. So I had to sell my cradles and stuff like that before I moved up here. So it's just 
And then you realize how much clothes you ended up selling for the reborn babies. Oh my God. Either I sold the clothes or I donated them to charity and <laughs> uh, didn't realize till just now that it's like all my Halloween outfits are gone. It's so sad. So now I have to get creative and try to make some stuff for Halloween. But I loved, you know, putting dressing up all the babies for Halloween. And that was my way of decorating. And, you know, I want to do that for Christmas too. And I'm sure my Christmas shelf is, yeah, I'm just very low on those outfits. But I've been in this community for five plus years now. So... You know, I've shown the same outfits over and over again. And so I just kind of would like to do something different. But then, you know, I was hoping by now I'd have a job. And then if something new came out or I saw something on clearance or in the thrift store, I'd be able to buy it. So anyways, this video is getting really, really long. And I'll let you guys go for theme sorry. Theme, the best theme sorry. <laughs> theme Thursday, guys. So... Sorry for rambling and complaining a bit, but sometimes you have to get a little stuff off your chest and talk about it, so. But otherwise, I'm doing good. So, waiting for the weather to cool off and turn into fall here in the desert, so it should be starting to get cold soon and winter will be coming. Fun part about the desert is, yeah, you miss fall. There's no falling leaves, changing of the leaves color. It's like, oh, I miss the seasons. But it's really pretty in springtime or summer. What was it when I moved down here at the end of May and all the cactuses were flowering? That was really pretty. But I'll let you guys go. So thanks for watching. And remember, guys. You're never too old for dolls. Bye.